Hey everybody, it's Blue Turtle, and welcome back to Splatoon 3. We've got some hot news off of the press. Urgent announcement from Grizzco. They're always hiring, it's not really news, let me see the report. There's a big run incoming, which, I've, which has already been, so... This is a big run alert! Wait, we're under attack! Is that what it that means? Summons are hitting Undertow Spillway. Are they after the Splatlands? And here I thought their tastes weren't refined enough to care. An ambush from below, really? Are they too spineless to come meet us head on? Like a direct assault would be any less of a nightmare. Since it's not happening in the city itself, yet, I say we start showing how to we bite. Yeah, those punks are gonna be sorry they ever washed up in Splatsville. We will be sorry if, we, if they break through the spillway. Let's stop the Salmonids. Also, it does sound like they're going to do the one in the main area at some point. Offering some sort of kind of special reward. Just like last time and probably each time. It's a okay thing, I guess. <laughs> Let's show the summits who own, really run the city. Also, a new season challenge is on the way, which has already been <laughs> again. The, we're from the future, but th th this is interesting. You pay attention, so... What? Is it in this one? No, it's not. Oh, it is. I forget where I'm up to in space and time, but it's okay. Because we have an extra challenge level to go to. Which would be interesting. So, let's go ahead and take a look at challenge. Which I believe this one means that we get no abilities, no extra abilities abilities on our uh, ability like on our things on our uh, armor equipment equipment we're also doing a special battle type thing so it's like a anarchy battle basically okay battle time let's go this is also a pretty interesting level but yeah we have basically no abilities now which is going to make this very weird we're not going to have as much of everything that we normally have. Which means that we really have to just fight our best, and that's all we can really do. So let's see what we can do. Getting close to the middle. Because the middle is an interesting area on this map. Since this is a new one. I do like this level. It's a bit small, but it, it does work, so. Especially if you use these side upper areas well. Just paint as much as we can. I think it's just a turf war in this round, isn't it? I think so. In future ones, there will be... Uh, different... Stuff. It will still be... Like... All sorts of things, like... I can't remember what they're called. Uh... I really didn't do plan for this very well, did I? I really didn't. But anyway. There'll be splat zones and stuff like that. All the special... Modes. Plus, also different uh, combinations of things. Because this one is just no uh, extra abilities. But that's not that's not a normal thing. That's going to be different every time, so... We are really not doing well this round. But that's to be expected, probably, when we're not used to the way that this plays, so... But it is an interesting, different way to play, I guess. Because we're not... We're doing it the way we're not used to. Oh boy, that landed directly on me. I feel like the challenge, like events, are a lot more luck based <laughs> somehow, because it's it's all about matchmaking and how well people can actually go against stuff when they're not used to it. And it, it must be a shame for anyone that I <laughs> that gets stuck with me, but it's fine. Oh boy, they're really pushing us back. We have to like take them out to be able to push forward, so we can't just rush into this. As advertised by two of the teammates just getting destroyed at once. If we can get our specials going, that'd be nice. There goes the other teammate, and there goes me. Yeah, I don't think we're getting back into this this round. That's fine. There's no way to make this recover this, but that, let's just try our best. Anything can change in a turf war battle in the last 30 seconds. But we do need to take the enemies out without dying ourselves. We can't push forward too much, which is what I'm doing. It's fine, maybe, if I can just take them out. No, it's not gonna work. Maybe, if I can just distract them a little bit. 
No. All my team is down. There's no way. 22 seconds left. Somebody's jumping in. Why? That's not how jumping in works. I hope you know. It makes you a lot more vulnerable than you would like. Come on. Maybe. I don't think so, but maybe. Based on the fact that I'm the only more person still alive. Oh my goodness. I really was. I really was last person standing. But also, I don't think it's going to be enough. Nah. Nah. Well, we fought hard, but not hard enough. And now it calculates part of our power based on how we did. And it's going to do that with each event that runs. It's also not all just like start to finish an event. It's also like sometimes multiple events at different times throughout the event time, basically. So you have to get different scores at different points in the event, basically. Not that you will, because it's going to be at random times, basically, but it's fine. It's there for people who can make it to it. It's just strange, to be honest, that it's like that. Here we go again. Let's see how we go this time. In this level, I love this level. I, I missed this level for a long time. But here we go in challenge, going as a decently scored team. It's about what you'd expect. They have three of the same weapon. That is a little bit concerning. We actually have four of that weapon in this lobby right now. For some reason. I guess it's the, the popular one. Because of the way it works. With its specials and all that. Booyah bomb and... It's just pretty good at covering ground in close combat anyway, so... If you can get into close combat. Yeah, I have no idea how this round's gonna go based on the fact of the weapons and what they are. I mean, I have Blob Lover, which is probably good, except for when I'm bad, so... That's the real problem. And they also have dualies. If we had more range, maybe it'd be fine. But, nah. Oh my goodness, this is just sad. And the thing about that... Aerospray... Is that you can basically just walk around, paint the ground. You don't have to, like, stay in guard this position, you're just gonna push and get as many points that way, which I guess makes sense. Because any points you get from the enemy's base is minus points to them and plus points to you, so that's just how, it, how that's just a good strategy. It reminds me of the Ice Castle in Donkey Kong 64, with a minigame in there where you have to flip the tiles. And if you just flip the opponent's tiles that they're flipping, it would just you basically just win. But here we go, we're at a minute and 23 seconds left. And they are still really pushing forward into the middle. If I could just get a little bit more control and actually take them out, that'd be nice. But that's really not happening. They're so wormy. There we go, got one. That sprinkler's still there though, so that means that another one's still alive. Nearby-ish. And they have their specials. Wow, how did we get them through that? I don't know. Okay, last minute. It's now or never. Oh boy. If I can just push their base with my ink across here, maybe. I mean, it'll slow them down, I think, but they're also still getting their specials pretty fast. Which might be because I'm putting, giving them so much air to cover in their base, so... Uh, I have concerns. They are all over the place. What is going on? Please. No. It's so hard to get a kill with Blob Lover from this distance. You kind of have to surprise them, and this is not how it's going to work. Nope, there we go. 20 seconds left. Man, now and ever is such a good theme. For the end of the fights. Two sprinklers, we could use that as shields, kind of. Just need to cover more ground, make sure we get rid of them if we can. They're using a special, so let's cover a different area. Maybe. I don't know if that's going to be enough. Maybe? It depends on how the sides are going. Um, it's all right. Did we win? Yes. That was actually probably a lot closer than it looked. I don't know. It looked close, is what I'm trying to say. I don't know.
Also, went over when we put a marker on that that little card there. And if we get five during the the short event times or the long event time, and it might be different every time, I don't know. But if you get that, you get a little token which you can use in the shell out machine. Here we go again. I feel like I'm gonna keep struggling, just consistently. Here we go. Just gonna cover some ground. Trying to cover the base. Man, I remember when I started playing Splatoon 3 and kind of wasn't the best at understanding how to play Splatoon because I haven't played much Splatoon 2 and 1. I mean, I played both of them a decent amount, but not enough, I guess. But now, I know the importance of base coverage. Every little, every little point helps. And it also helps to be able to push forward again, so... But I guess you could also leave bits of the base uncovered so you can cover them later and then get points. But if you need, if you need that much coverage in your base to push forward again, you're already being pushed back, so... You probably will just be able to paint over their stuff to get more points, so... It's probably not a problem, it's just fine. Just play as well as you can. I really need to play more stealth in Splatoon. I always try and push forward, and I'm always tossing stuff, but I should actually like stay still and wait for a kill to be available for me. Like right there, that was- well, that would have been good, except there wasn't an enemy there. But I really should play more stealth, I really missed that. How did that land down there? I guess it just landed on the wall. That's fine. Are uh, we being pushed back a little bit? Maybe? No? Cool. Oh, spot somebody's jumping in. Gonna just be careful about this so that we don't get taken advantage of while we're busy. Stealth? Nope. <laughs> Doesn't matter. They're all fairly far back now, so... We can start pushing a little bit forward. Although they're slipping through the cracks now, and we're gonna die. If we're not careful, where are you going? That's not going to help you. I'm amazed at the, the strategies of Splatoon players. Because sometimes people just go to the other side with the stuff that they're doing getting immediately removed behind them. And then they die. <laughs> it's just a, always a thing. There's always people who play the same strategies that you've seen since the beginning of time, basically. Since the beginning of Splatoon, there's, there's, there's still the same strategies. That people use for some reason. It's just interesting to see how people think the same and different people and all that, so. Come on, please. Nope. That would have been so good, though. Also, like the contact lenses things as equipment because it basically means you don't have anything that you have to wear, but you have it there. Interesting. <laughs> just gotta do that. Sprinkler is helpful for just taking out somebody who's jumping in. Just so it does a bit of damage when they land in and then I can do the rest. Just gonna push that base like that. A little bit. I mean, my, my shot didn't really help, but still. Look at that coverage. Very nice. Okay, here we go. I'm pretty sure I've seen some of these people before. Cornflakes I've definitely seen before. Fry's toes. What is going on? Ah, it's fine. It's Splatoon, everybody. Anyway, I'm just gonna paint the base. I mean, I've seen Incineroar in lobbies, but I'm pretty sure that's just been for this event, so... I might have seen it in other times, but I don't know. I can't remember anything. Well, so far so good. Just painting areas for the moment. Making sure there's nobody sleeping past me. Uh, looks like the other team is trying to gain control with their specials. Trying. They've covered a lot of ground. They have some good range. Decent range. Also, they have a paintbrush. 
paintbrushes are strong, like ridiculously strong for some reason. Oh, we got to disconnect. Is it going to end the round or is it going to keep going? It looks like it's just going to keep going. No, it's going to stop. Okay. Well, I guess that's fine. <laughs> Don't have to worry about the paintbrush. Fry hands? What's going on here? <laughs> how, do, how do I... Have I not noticed this? What's going on? Fry hands and fry's toes. Well, it's fine. Let's just, let's see how this goes now. Got different players now, so... Got the paintbrush on our side now. Interesting. Got a long-range blaster, I think that is? I don't know. It's a blaster, I'm pretty sure. I, like, I know for sure. Is it long range? I, like, I think the way that looks, it is. I'm trying to actually learn the way that weapons look a bit more because I've I've seen all the weapons, like... I, I've, I feel like I should know these things a lot more than I do, basically. I'm so good at remembering things in other games, but I don't know. I think as I get older, <laughs> my memory's just getting worse. And remembering things less that I should be able to memorize. Need to flex my memory more so I can actually get better at it. Well, so I'm pretty sure I've seen player before, but I'm. There are probably several play people who call themselves player for some reason. Hello. No slipping through. Bad. No slipping through here. Was not expecting the bomb toss at me. Okay, interesting. Wipe out pretty good. Let's try and keep it clean. Gonna push that base with my shots. Be very annoying. Gonna be an annoying blah blah blah. Tossing into the enemy's base. Oh boy, specials everywhere. And also long range blaster. Yeah, range blaster. I was actually right about that. I'm surprised. It just looks a little bit different. actually get back in there. I don't remember any of the rest of the names of the, the weapons though, so I should really... <laughs> remembering the long range blaster is the least of my problems probably. Okay, they are really all over the place again. Gonna start having problems in here. That was a good kill. I like that. That's the advantage of stealth with the blah blah. Wipe out, very nice. Gonna stealth again. Wait for them to get a little bit closer and then go. That's not gonna be enough. They were too far away. Oh! Just don't get too close to the. Never mind. Just never mind. Ah, uh, they could actually take this back at this point if we're not careful. They've definitely got a lot of specials for covering areas, so. But we need to cover that back now. And also take them out, not let them get us. We go above, maybe. Nice, got it. Okay, they're still in danger, so we should be able to take this. They really need a lot more points right now to win. So they have to take us out. So I think we've got this in the bag at this point. Unless they somehow get a full wipeout and use all their specials all at once. As efficiently as possible. But, nope, not gonna happen. <coughs> it's interesting, looking at this from a different angle. Like looking, like when you're in a Splatoon match, it's just like huh, 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 everything everywhere all at the same time. But actually looking back at it from above, basically, there's a lot more strategy involved that you should really be able to think about on the spot if you can. But yeah, it's difficult, I guess. I don't know. Here we go. I believe. Oh no. I believe in oh no. Here we go. Just gonna paint base because nobody else will. I seem to be back here a lot while everyone's going forward. It just happens all the time. I mean, if I just stay here and get all this, I'm getting a lot of points for my everything, I guess. It's gonna help me get level ups, probably. I think that's how that works, maybe? I might be wrong about that. But it's also gonna help me fill in the Wonder Crust. Crust. 
stuff on the Splatnet thing on the Nintendo Switch Online app. It's very helpful to have that, by the way, for ch like um for challenges. If you if you want to know when the challenges are on, have a look at the Nintendo Switch Online app because that will tell you when it's on, what time. It just has everything you need to know about Splatoon 3, basically. For the most part. Probably? I haven't checked it for all the time, but it's, it's... Like, every time I've looked at it, it's had everything you need to know, basically. For big runs, challenges, Splatfests... Just everything. And of course, it's got a special shop that you can get more gear from if you play all the time, so... If you play all the time, there's a good place to be, I guess. It's also got, I think, um voice chat stuff if you want to do that that way probably w would be recommended probably but it's a little bit of a a weird setup for that as well from what I know we are really getting pushed back at the moment need to get some control going which I might be able to do if I don't go like that way that way careful nope I need to use my sprinkler as a like a backup thing also, I just realized why everyone's gear has the, like, question mark, question mark, question mark on it. It's because that's just how it is for the event. Like, for some reason, I thought everyone was using basic gear, which is odd, because everyone usually has fully equipped gear with all the same abilities and stuff, but no. It's just what it is for the event. And then, yeah, I think you still get the main, main ability, but no sub-abilities. We are really getting pushed back. Except they are also almost getting pushed back. So if we can just hold on a little bit more. Get some more coverage. Hello. That one's retreating. <laughs> oh, hello. Please, thank you. Nice. Okay, now we really need to get control because otherwise we are in trouble. Nope. I'm gonna die. I'm definitely gonna die. There's a thing lobbing stuff at me. Okay. 11 seconds left. 10. Uh, I can jump in in seven seconds. I don't know if I can do much. Hopefully I won't die because then I'll be really bad. I think we've got this. Almost. It's gonna be close, but I think we got this. No, we got it. It's not as close as I thought, but we got it. One, 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 one. Okay, challenge power, 1,755. Now I know. I mean, that's pretty middle of the road, to be honest. You kind of want it like 2,000 or above, if you're like really good, but I'm not, so I'm not going to reach that. Okie dokie. Hey, it's Incineroar again. I'm pretty sure we changed lobbies and Incineroar was back. That's interesting. Wow, that person's finished their... <laughs> The person with the Crossy Sean shirt? Question mark? They've they've completed the Wonder Crust 3. So they're doing good. They play a lot, probably. A lot more than me, so. It's probably not hard. It's so hard to play Splatoon a lot. You have to get so hooked on the game. I feel like it's difficult to get hooked onto a multiplayer online game. But that might just be me. If I only ever played Splatoon, I'd be fine. But I I, I have I like variety. I, I ha have to variety, basically. Otherwise I get so sick of doing the same thing. And there's also so many games I want to play, so... There's so many good games. I can't imagine playing only one. Please, don't kill me. Live. Nope. Well, at least I got a kill. Just gonna bump stuff around. It's fine. Ah, uh, we're in danger, so we really need to take our time. If we can. Cover some ground. I really shouldn't be jumping into the middle right now. I don't know why I tried that, but I got a kill. That's good. Just stay alive. No, I'm gonna die, aren't I? Maybe. Not yet. There we go. 
We really need to actually take some time here. But we're not. It's fine. Let me actually go around the sides and clean up a little bit. Hope that my team does a good job with the rest of it. If I can at least like, be a distraction, <laughs> that's all I can be good for in this game, is a distraction. Ah, uh, please don't kill me. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for obliging. Oh my goodness, they're getting around us. I'm gonna die. No, we're good. It's fine. Did I just hit something? Oh my goodness, I did. There we go. I love when that happens. It just never does, but it happened then, so that was nice. Uh, we have a decent coverage now. Oh, because we had, they had a disconnect. That's why the t tables have turned. Well, that makes sense. It's a shame, but we have to take advantage of it, so... If they're not gonna... If Nintendo's not gonna do anything, we, we're gonna abuse the system until they decide to add AI... ...characters in. I don't know, computer characters. They can do it. They can do it, but they haven't. And we're gonna abuse it until they fix it. I don't know. I feel- I'm always sorry for the other team that has a disconnect. When it doesn't stop for some reason. What are you doing? Don't do that. <sighs> At the very least, just cover your base and don't die or something. And just get points, basically. <laughs> Just don't come over and dance. Just get- get points. Hey, 69! <laughs> Got far too excited by that. Hey, there we go. <laughs> Thank you for the disconnect. I'm sorry for your loss. Also, it keeps track of our highest challenge power during an event, so we can know how well we did. Also, we got the shell out token. So use that eventually. Let's go again. Interesting. Very interesting. Interesting selection of weapons. Two blob lobbers, so let's see how they go against each other. Which is me, so it's probably not going to go well. Ah, uh, but we've also got some splatter shots. And a brush. And uh, whatever the other one is, because I don't remember. But this is interesting, so let's find out. Just going to paint as much as I can to begin with. Get all these points. I mean, look, I've got... 300. Is that the team points? I think it's the team points, isn't it? Or maybe it is just personal points. I think it's supposed to be personal points. It does appear to be. Like, it's not going up when I'm not doing anything, so... That's how I know I'm actually doing something. Get rid of that, because that's going to be annoying. Just going to take a second to recover some ink, because they're going to... Really, they're really pushing us right now. It's us against them, and they're doing pretty decent. They're doing really decent, wow. Trying special to keep them back. There's also the other blob blob there that we might want to take out. Ah. 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 I got splattered. By somebody who was down. That seems... Uh, that's a real shame. Anyway. Let's jump back in. Just gonna go for it. Or not. Okay. Fine. Well, this isn't going to go well for me then, is it? Please, 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 please let me live. I'm not recovering. I need to get things to recover. Please, back up, back up, back up. Okay, there we go. We're good. Nope, we're not good anymore. How did that go so bad for us? Being in the back area. The back rooms. <laughs> How did it go so bad for us in the back rooms? I don't know. Let's not get reviewed. Boy, you're distracted. That's how Blob Blob is... We, blah, bah, I feel like Blob Lovers are the most likely character players to backstab each other. I'm sure that every character who uses the same weapon against each other are ready to backstab. Backstab is the only word I can use to describe that. Okay, interesting. There's a lot of stuff going on. 
try and push from this angle. Nope. The backstabbing returned. Well, that's fair enough. Oh, so what is that badge? Off the, like, road. Oh, that's probably like a DLC thing, isn't it? I think there's probably DLC badges. Maybe? That's the, that's the only thing I can think of that that would be. Off the top of my head, let's see what we did. Uh, I think we won. Maybe. No. Just comparing my t the our attacks in their base against theirs, they had a lot more coverage in our base. Let's go again, another round. Now, what do we have here? Interesting. <laughs> End zaps versus whatever that stuff is. <laughs> They've got a gold arrow spray though, so. And they have a rapid blaster, is that what that is? I'm probably wrong about that. I really need to, I really need to learn the weapon names and stuff. But they've also got a pretty good Squiffer. Probably wrong name for that as well. I'm trying. <laughs> like, I, I need to just look at what they look like as icons and know what the names are. I need, like, little flashcards or something so I can learn weapon names. Or something. Ah, the pain. Well, wipe out. Well, time to defend the base because we can't push forward. I mean, we're going to try and push forward, but it's not going to work, so... That's about how this is going to go. Based on the fact that we have end zaps. I'm going to try and push forward a little bit here. Need to actually get some kills though. Nope. Got hit from behind. By the point .52 gal. Right, that's what that is. I really should have known that. I, like, I really should have known that. They're using their splash wall really well. And they're working together as well. Really well. Well, 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 well. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Let's get rid of this thing, please. They're really just really being annoying. And we are not taking our time. It's fine. Uh, risky move, but will it work? Will it pay off? I'll put that there and try to support. Uh, I don't know about this. I can push forward, but I don't know how much I can help. We're all down here now. That's not going to go well for us, I don't think. Maybe? Maybe? If we just take this one out. No, that's, that's looking doubtful. They're going to take back control now. Or something. Please. No. No. Please. Why? At least I got the rebound to work. It's fine. Everything's fine. Just need to push for a little bit longer. Or hold... Re retreat? Something. We need to be careful for a little bit longer. I'm the only one alive. We're definitely going to fail this. <laughs> We're definitely doing really bad. They're, they're really pushing us back. They had, a, they had a much better team weapon selection. Well, I'm just going to go for it since it's the end of the round anyway. Well, maybe next time. I'm going to stop being cursed. Why am I always so cursed? Maybe if I play more, I'll get a better matchmaking stuff. Okay. Let's try this again. Hopefully with different weapons this time. That looks better. And yeah, this is going to be interesting to see how this goes. We might have a bit of trouble with this. But if we play well enough, I believe in us. I will believe in us if we play well enough. But only, only when we play well enough. <laughs> that could have been good, but nope. Let's try and work over the edge of this thing. Nope, they went around. That was a good move. Let's jump back 
back in. Get some of this stuff. Paint it again. Just paint whatever I can. Also, I don't know how to feel about the music in this latest season. I mean, it, it's it's all right, but I feel like it's not as in, like it's not as enjoyable as previous musics from the seasons have been. But maybe it depends on my mood, I guess, and how the game's going. Ah, well, that didn't work. Well, that was from behind me. Interesting with a suction bomb. Okay. Well, I'm just bad then. <laughs> Try and cover some of this up. There's still a lot of small gaps in our base area. And they're really pushing up middle stuff. Please don't die. Tetradulis, why? Dark Tetradulis. <laughs> really struggling. Once again, two of us are down. We really need to take a time. Okay, everyone's back up again. Let's try and take a time pushing the center. Back into place. It might actually be good to go around. But I'm not going to do that because I don't ever think about that. But it might be a good idea. Uh, interesting. I'm going to just duck down for a bit. Take my time. You can use those walls down there to get up. It's, it's a very good idea to probably use that. We have a be decent coverage of the middle now. Can we keep it up? And also get some kills maybe. Because that's the thing that's going to decide who wins this match, I think. Oh my goodness, please no. It's fine. Get up. Go. Run. It's fine. Still got a bit of goop at the end of the edges of the screen. That's fine. I really let that one get away, didn't I? Need to make sure that they don't get past me. Up to me. Like they did. Just didn't get exploded. Also, I just noticed that splash from the end of that thing there. There's like a few droplets of ink that dropped out of this, this special after they were done. Specials are dangerous. <laughs> also, what is this mess of coverage we call a level? I don't know. Oh, hello. Please, let me survive. Get a few more points, maybe. A bit more coverage, that's all I want. Good enough. How we go. Oh my goodness, look at this. <laughs> look at this mess. We lost, okay. Didn't even get 42.0. Alright. A few different people, I think. Two blob lovers on our side. Interesting. I think we'll be fine. But still, still gonna take my time regardless. Also, that was like flawless synchronization with these two blob lovers. Never mind. There's a lot of uncovered area here, which I'm gonna go over. But I mean, it's still working out pretty well for us. We're just doing little bits of each other's work to just get as much coverage as we can. Start off. Ah, I'm gonna die. <laughs> I almost did. Okay, let's try and use our specials now. Get some more coverage. Bit of points. We have other players to really focus on the attack, probably. While we can support a little bit. Get the basic coverage everywhere. Use our sprinklers as shields, possibly, a little bit. Oh! Oh! They jumped away. Come on. I really need to place a good sprinkler. There we go. I'm not sure if that's the best place for it, but it's a, at least it's placed, so I can cover up some of their stuff. Lure some of them out. We have we have a decent coverage right now, so I'm just going to take out you. You hiding back there is not going to help me. Oh boy. Try using something special. Lure some people out into it, maybe. Oh boy. It's just the blow blow is still standing. Ah, and I've been marked. Oh boy, please don't. No, 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 no. It's fine. And I at least got through with the people so I could get let my other teammate jump in. Without problems. It's always risky when you're the person being jumped to. Or if the person's jumping, to, like you're the person jumping. Because they can get you really fast if they know how to. And if you throw your bomb right as 
the arrow's draining away. You can get them to explode on it immediately, so. That's how you time the, the bomb, basically. It's based on the arrow depleting. Ah, dying. Gotta take a second to recover. Use my sprinkler well to keep this ground covered. Never mind the people here. I'm the only person standing. Oh my goodness. Oh boy, please, no, 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 no. And we're down, basically. Oh my goodness. 30 seconds to make this ground back. I don't think we're gonna do it, to be honest. But maybe if we get some kills. We need to get them now, though. Hello. Nah, that's it. Maybe? Specials could be good. Nah, we only one of them worked. One third of a special. I'm not looking too hopeful with this round. But anything's possible, I guess. We need to cover this up so it doesn't cause problems because it's negative points to us. It's fine. Nope, I don't think we've done it. No, nah, there's no way. Yeah. But anyway, that's probably it for now. So thank you all for watching. Actually, no, I'm going to do the shout out quickly and that'll be it. <laughs> but thank you all for watching anyway. Okay, so let's use the shout out token here in the shout out machine. Like that. And gets us a food ticket. Okay. <laughs> it can give you a lot of random stuff, so. But we didn't get anything good from that. Anyway, thank you all for watching. I'll see you all next time.